Book talk. So first thing, I'm excited. Someone commented on one of the book talks. Thanks yep. for giving more suggestions. For uh, have you read their series? The the other one. Yeah. By uh, Ralts Bloodthorn. Uh, Ralts Bloodthorn. I've I've read the the Dark, the dark series, Ages. Right? Dark Ages. Yeah, dark I, haven't, ages. I haven't read that one. Yeah. So what have you read this past week? So I was cycling back to another series. Recycle time. Okay. Yeah. Um, it's the Weir Creek. Weir Key Chronicles. Oh, they're going to say diaries. No. <laughs> Weir Key Chronicles. Say that again five times fast. I can't now. <laughs> by uh, by Sarah Lynn. Do it. Uh, Sarah Lynn, Weir Creek Chronicles. Weir. Weir. Key. W E apostrophe R E. Weir Key Diaries. W E I R Key. Key E Y? K E Y? Yep. Okay. Okay. As in the key that you put in a door and turn. Uh, Chronicles. The uh, the first book in the series is called uh, Soul Home. Um, and this is this is what's fascinating is because you know it's it's more or less like a sci fi series, right? And so how it starts out is you've got the the main character, the the hero, with his his compatriots, the protagonist. Yeah, the protagonist, and uh, you know they're they're. They've got the magics. They're super powerful. They've got all the badass gear, whatever. Um, and they're like, man, what's going on with this world that we've gotten to? And about that time, his more or less sponsor, the person who's been kind of guiding him around these fantasy worlds, shows up and is like, joke's on you, bitch. I was just using you the whole time. And he's he the bad guy. Kills him. Okay, so bye-bye protagonist. And he wakes back up on Earth. Because what had happened was he was like a young kid. So he was dreaming. And no. He was a young kid and he got like his soul or whatever got pulled to a different world. Got pulled to an alternative world. But so the protagonist died. He right. Was killed and by then he, his teacher. Yeah. And then he woke up at, as his young younger self. So right? kind of like, like rewind time and he's young again. Yeah. But he's back on earth now. With going back in time or at his current time, it's like nothing, like no, no, like no time. Nothing went by. changes. Okay, right. So he proceeds to spend the next, I think it's like fifty years, trying to find a way back to his proper to, to time. the fantasy world. Oh, okay, to to the I think they call it the nine worlds, right? Um, okay, uh, and. Finally, he does, and he like stumbles through a portal from Earth into the nine nine realms or worlds or whatever, and he's like young again because like he was an old man when he went through right like mm -hmm. liver spots the whole shebang, and he's like young again, but he's got like an old soul, and now he's got to try and get revenge. First off, figure out how much time has gone by in the nine worlds because clearly time doesn't work the same, right? Then he needs to like get powerful again and get revenge. And how you like get magic and abilities and everything is you kill people. Well, yeah, kind of, but no, not really. <laughs> is you Take literally revenge. go into your soul and you build a home. Okay. And depending on how you build it will give in what materials you build it out of in your soul home. Depends on what kind of abilities and powers you get. Interesting. So if you build a mansion, you get more powers? Depends on what materials you make it out of. And depends on what architect, like how you architect it, right? Like how many chambers it has, what the flow of, you know, uh, energy through it is like, and the whole shebang. They get real deep. It, I'm a I'm a sucker for like technical magic books, yeah. like where they get really into the technicalities of how the magic works. Um, that's my cell phone. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, so like I'm I'm all about this, but it's a very fascinating take on a magic system, right? And I'm really in, into it. And I've been reading it since I think book three came out, and now it's book seven is out. I mean, it sounds interesting. I don't know if I personally would dive into it. It sounds interesting, but it also sounds really weird. And it, it it's only weird because it's not something normal for me. Like, 
when you look at somebody who's acting different than what you're used to, you're like, that's weird. Like, why are you acting that way? Right. So for me, like that whole building a house inside your soul to get powers type of thing is weird to me because that's so, just I not mean, something that I would, I, I, I've experienced kind of thing. I get behind. <clears throat> He's over here. Okay. I get behind alter, like alternate fantasy magics, right? Because like we're all used to like Lord of the Rings yeah. or D and D or whatever magic systems, right? Magic with lore. Yeah. So whenever someone introduces like a, a new, new subject unique, or a new way to do it, yes, I'm I'm very interested in it, right? I mean, I I could see that. It's just I think that'd probably be a slow book series for me. So when you have a a nice different way to look at something completely it gives you a different perspective it's like that was a pretty cool idea yeah and you know what? sure you know what? i'm up for listening or reading more about it and it's it's fantasy it's sci-fi it's magic it's like yeah let's go into this let's let's build more of my lore knowledge this gives me more ideas for other stuff and i can understand it not being like a book series for everyone but because it has multiple different worlds... It sounds like it has different facets that it'll touch people yeah. differently, yeah. yeah. Is it like multiple worlds on the same planet, or is it like multiple worlds in a galaxy? No, it, it's... Well, it's multiple different worlds, almost in multiple different universes, right? Okay. It's like a multiverse. And it's called the Weird Key Chronicles because you use the keys to travel between worlds. It's like, like a it's almost key. like a key to a yeah, kind of like a port key. It's kind of like a port key if you portal. go with Harry yeah, Potter. Yeah, to, to a portal. 